electrical system. Today we will talk about airfoils and the generation of lift. First, let's take a look at the different types of airfoils. This is a symmetric airfoil and these are cambered airfoils. Applications of airfoils can be found in aircraft wings, propeller blades, high-speed cars and even in birds. To see the terms used in airfoil, let's use a cambered airfoil. The point at the front of the airfoil is called as the leading edge, point at the back is called as the trailing edge. The line joining the leading and the trailing edge is called as the cord line. The camber line is the line which divides the airfoil into two equal halves. The distance between the camber line and the cord line is called as the camber and the maximum distance is called as the maximum camber. Thickness is the distance between the top and the bottom surface of the airfoil. Angle of incidence is the angle between the cord line and the horizontal axis. Angle of attack is the angle between the cord line and the direction of the airflow. To understand how lift is created, there are different theories. We will just call it theories theory number 1, theory number 2 and theory number 3. Theory number 1. It considers particles that are split by the airfoil. So if we have two particles, they get split at the leading edge. These particles will meet back together at the trailing edge. The particle on top covers the greater distance, which means its speed should be more. As the speed increases, the pressure decreases, causing a low pressure region on the top and a high pressure region at the bottom. This difference causes an upward force which is called as lift. The drawback of this theory is that the top and bottom particles are assumed to meet at the trailing edge, but experiments have proved they won't meet. It will look something like this, which means theory number one is wrong. The second theory is based on Newton's third law, which states that every action has an equal and opposite reaction. So as the airfoil moves forward, the air gets pushed downwards at the trailing edge. This is the action. The airfoil gets pushed upwards, which is the reaction, also called as the lift force. The drawback is that it gives a general idea on the creation of lift, and it cannot be calculated. Theory number 3 is based on Bernoulli's and Euler's equations. We will directly see the application of these equations. If we focus on the particle going over the top surface of the airfoil, as it reaches the point of maximum thickness, the speed reduces and the pressure increases. This high pressure pushes the top particle towards the trailing edge of the airfoil, which increases the speed of the top particle. According to Bernoulli's equation, as the speed increases, the pressure decreases creating a low pressure at the top and a high pressure at the bottom. This pressure difference causes the lift force. The lift can be calculated using this formula, where rho is the density, v is the velocity, s is the surface area, and cl is the coefficient of lift. Let's look at the coefficient of lift. It depends on the body's shape, the angle of attack, and the air properties such as viscosity. The location of the camber line also has an effect on the lift, which means if the camber line is located above the cord line, the lift acts upward. If the camber line is below the cord line, the lift acts downward. The speed with which the airfoil moves forward has a direct impact on the lift, which means more speed is more lift. Less speed is less lift. This area also has a direct effect on the lift, but it cannot be increased too much as the particles will not stick to the surface and affect the lift. The density of air has a direct relation with the lift, which means as the altitude increases, the density decreases and the lift reduces. If the altitude decreases, the density increases and the lift increases. Different airfoils can be designed by varying the cord length, the thickness, and the camber, depending on the lift equation and the lift requirement and used in different places.